and now it's my turn to get sick i'm really sad over it because it's christmas um, on tuesday it's sunday today but we celebrate christmas with my some of my family tomorrow because we will celebrate christmas eve with tobias's family um i will sleep in at my parents tomorrow until the day of christmas and christmas night too it's hard to explain but that is the plan <clears throat> and then uh, yeah i just got sick and i don't know if it is because of the tooth that is inflammated so it spreads in my body or whatever but i have a real sore throat and i can't really breathe i have a lot of asthma i get like my resting pulse is 104 and i get out of breath just by standing up i don't have a fever though but i don't know if it's because it's because i take aspirin or if i wouldn't either way but i hate this i never i never get sick and of course i'm gonna get sick for christmas but I, it won't, it won't stop me. I'm still gonna celebrate Christmas somehow. <laughs> if I don't get a fever, I will go with Tobias to his family. If I do get a fever, I'm gonna be at my parents to celebrate Christmas. Maybe in my room, and maybe lying down, maybe sleeping. I don't know. But you know what to do. Um, I'm gonna film some Christmassy stuff. I won't talk much because I don't like vlogging with Tobias's family because I find it weird talking in English to my phone. So I'm just going to film some, put some music over it, maybe do some voiceovers or whatever. And we'll see how it turns out to be. But I am still going to show you some of the Christmas stuff we do, even though I'm not very well. And I'll talk a little bit too. But yeah, today is in Sweden we say dawn for the dawn for the dawn for the dawn. The day before the day of the... The day before the day of, before the day of Christmas or whatever. Okay, have a good one. these cute things from Louisa's family you can build them upwards and you can also <clears throat> yes we're playing with them put them <laughs> she wants to kick them put them inside of each other and then you can do them like a train if you see there's oh and then plastic so that's really cute right Leona right and she likes kicking them Right now I'm just so exhausted and sad and it's Christmas and I'm just worse today. Now it's not it's the day before Christmas Eve. At least your little tongue cheers me up. 
But Tobias has to work today because uh, the camp is sick when he's a mailman and it's the last day before Christmas and everything. So they need all the manpower. And I have slept for like an hour last night because she didn't, she refused to sleep and I couldn't sleep. And I'm really sick today. And I just feel like it's very, very hard and very, very painful to feel like this. And I need to get to my parents somehow because they need to be able to rest today a little bit. I hope my mom can help me even though she has so much to do with Christmas. I'm never sick. I'm never, never sick. But when I do get sick, I get really sick. And everything will be hard this Christmas. I was looking forward to it. And it's the first Christmas I'm going to spend without my family. Which is hard in itself. And then why oh, I have to feel like this? It's, oh, I hate it. I hate it. If I don't have a high fever, I'm going to go either way. But <clears throat> I'm going to get us ready and go to my parents. I have been sleeping for an hour at my parents. Which is good. I just feel really dizzy now, of course. Like my blood pressure is on a low when you have slept only an hour and then you sleep. I'm so sad because I was thinking I'm gonna do a really Christmas Christmas vlog when we celebrate Christmas here and we celebrate Christmas at Tobias's family, but this will just be like I don't know what it will be. This is the truth this year. This is what it looks like, I guess. And people hate me, <laughs> not people, some hate that I share only bad stuff but what can I do I'm sick and it's not fun it's a reality and it's the truth and I hate it the first Noel the angel did say was to certain Shepherds in fields as they lay In fields where they lay Keeping their sheep On a cold winter's night That was so deep Noel, 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 Noel Born is the King of Israel They look it up and saw a star Shining in the east Beyond them far And to the earth It gave great light And so
So it's Christmas Eve and my throat is killing me. Totally. It's not getting any better and I don't want to talk. I just feel like I want to be quiet today. So, happy Christmas. My throat only gets worse and worse and worse, and now it hurts. Even being quiet, even when I'm breathing, even when I'm not breathing, it hurts every second. And this is the first real Christmas I'm gonna spend with Tobias' family, which sucks that I have to have a feel like this. Number one, it's very hard to sit in the car and just go there, it's hard to be amongst people. I, I should lay down and rest. And it's hard to talk, so I'm gonna stop now. gifts Leona got because it was her first Christmas she got a lot of stuff I don't have all of them here but she got this really cute stuffed little mouse this cute little backpack some nice pants great like overalls or whatever you can have when you she's riding the car she got this awesome like activity bike thing she used this since since she got it, but we haven't put these on yet. I don't, I'm not sure really how to do it, so I'm gonna check that out later. This is not from your Tobias. We gave her one thing. The one thing we gave her was this elephant that plays peekaboo. I don't know what's wrong with the sound though, because it's really, really loud. And like that <laughs> and that she got that's the only thing she got from us then she got this amazing thing where you can l learn to walk and otherwise sit and play with it when she only can knows how to sit and you can also sit and play and learn to walk with it she's it's too early for her to stand with it but still this amazing blocks which is great we don't have any blocks um, she got a cute hat she got this cute little car so she has a lot of stuff she got some more clothes too a beautiful dress she got a book where you can feel stuff on this book which is a sleeping book like sleep stories that like 
a little meditation for ch children when she gets older. And this little ball. She got a lot of more stuff. I, I, I can't show you all because all of them weren't there. But you could see uh, kind of what she got. And she got this little board. She's about to. Hammer, hammer stuff, hammer fall. It's now December 26th. <laughs> I didn't feel much during Christmas. It was hard time for me because I was really, really sick when we were at uh, Tobias's um, sister's place. And I I had to, and if you know what I mean, I, I know the Santa really well, like really well, like we have almost the same hearts. And that made me want to faint when the Santa came into the room. So, because in Sweden we have Santa comes every Christmas Eve and hands out gifts to the children. So, um, that was what happened this year too. And I wanted to faint and it was really hard. I couldn't, I don't even remember when we opened the gifts for Leona because I was so sick. And she almost didn't sleep anything during that day. And it was... It was a hard day for me, so I Christmas for me is the best day of the year for me. Christmas this year was really, really hard, um, just because I was sick. Otherwise, it would take. I, would, I think we would have had a great time, and I like to visit family and stuff. So it's nothing about that, but it was very hard. I started to get an anxiety attack. So then, when I drove home, I drove to my parents with Eleona, and she was screaming a lot, and I didn't have any voice left. I couldn't get an invoice, so I couldn't comfort her in any way. All I could do was play cover, cover girl, and it didn't work out to play cover girl, um, unfortunately, because she was so sad and so tired and screamed a lot. So then we came home. I had the worst asthma attack I have ever, have ever had because I'm allergic to dogs, and there was a dog there, and I was sick. So my asthma was really, really bad for a while on the party. I almost couldn't breathe either. But when I came home, my entire throat was filled of phlegm, so I was like, oh, oh. I couldn't get it out and I couldn't get it down. So I couldn't breathe for a few seconds. It wasn't a long time, but it was really, really scary. I shouldn't have gone, really, but I wanted to go because it was Christmas. And um, some of my family, were, my family was, all, was there still. I couldn't even sit with them. I went by myself and then they went home. And when they went home, I was sitting with my sister and mom and dad. And we handed out gifts to each other because we have like we we give each other gifts every Christmas Eve during the night time, um, because we have made an arrangement that we give we give each other a few a few gifts with with a budget. So uh, to me that was uh, actually the best part of the entire Christmas because it was slowed down. Leona was sleeping in my arms. It was just like very calm warm i felt like okay now i can still feel like i had a great christmas even though the christmas wasn't what i wanted it to be and that made me sad because christmas is so important to me but i want to say it again it doesn't it wasn't a bad christmas because i was away from my family of course i would love being with my family but it was a bad christmas because i was really sick and i couldn't enjoy christmas either in my place with my family or at Spice's place with his family but that can happen and the day after christmas i was like today i'm just gonna rest because i was so sick and i slept with my parents to, to that day um and my throat really hurt i couldn't talk i couldn't swallow i couldn't anything <coughs> after i had slept for a while i could i felt like it felt a little bit better which was good unfortunately little leona got a really bad tummy flu stomach flu really bad like vomited everything she ate she either vomited or pooed exactly the moment she had finished eating which meant she couldn't keep anything down she didn't pee for the entire day until last night at 4 a.m so it was like uh, i was scared we were at the er but they were like she looks fine she's she looks happy and energized which leona always does we saw that she was a little bit tired but then she slept a lot during the night time and uh, yeah, kind of like that. And today she's better. She still poo. She still poos and not eat a lot, but she feels she's better. 
the, the day she turned five months, she got an ear infection. One week after that, she got a lot of asthma. We went to the hospital again. Uh, a week after that, she got a tummy flu. So what is what will happen next week? I don't know. I'm going to end this vlog here. This was not the cheery, happy Christmas vlog that I thought it would be. This was mostly me just sad, anxiety-filled, sick, um, Leona sick uh, and stuff. But I hope you enjoyed this vlogmas, even though it wasn't a vlogmas for 24 days, which was my plan. It hasn't worked out with a sick child and me being sick and everything. But I hope you had a great, great Christmas and that you enjoyed it and that you are taking care of each other and yourself and yeah thank you for following me always it means a lot to me to have my youtube family it means a lot and i mean a lot really really a lot um i'll talk to you when i talk to you bye